Welcome back to the number one podcast in your world. We're your hosts, Chase Demore and Gabrielle Moses. And today, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> and today we have a very special guest, my baby sister. Not really baby sister anymore. My little sister Cassie. Hi. She came all the way from North Carolina, so she's here today. And I said, Cassie, I think you need to come on the podcast because you grew up with me, so you got mm-hmm. to see firsthand. I grew up with you doing your. YouTube makeup videos and oh, YouTube God. makeup videos. No, she was stealing ideas off of cosmetology and sending it to the likes of people like me. Hey, God. you used to watch them, so it must have helped you somehow. It helped did. you with two out to handle. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm glad cosmetology is the number one reason. Cosmopolitan, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. But Cassie, why don't you tell them a little bit about yourself, other than the fact that you're my little sister. What are you up to right now with your life? Well, um, I'm a sophomore at NC State. I swim. Yep. Any fun facts? (laughs) (laughs) She's like, I'm just a swimmer. Uh, I'm an athlete. I'm an athlete. You know, it's a... It's flex like, your muscles? No. We're not no. going to do that. really big muscles, guys. That's why I always say flex your muscles. Um, she can do pull-ups. I can do pull-ups. How many pull-ups can you do? I don't know, like 20. <laughs> I can do two. <laughs> That's so cool. 20 is insane. Hold on. <laughs> Chase is like, I don't think, you know. I, think I can do 20. <laughs> don't you feel Thank like you. a weight around you He too? doubts me so much. He doubts my athleticism so much. Chase is like, I can't deny that one. Uh-oh. Guilty as charged. <laughs> these two are going to start fighting on the podcast. They actually have a bet. We have a bet that he'll never do. It's not, I would never. It's just like, I just don't feel like embarrassing the entire NCAA mm-hmm. with, their, with their selection of, of female course. swimmers. Of course. The bet funny. was who could swim right. faster. And this bet was made back in like 2021. It was, it was a long time ago. A very long time ago. Yeah. And it happened while we were in Hawaii. I was like, my little sister could definitely swim faster than you, Chase. Definitely. It doesn't matter that you're 6'5". Mm-hmm. You're going to sink. He thinks He'll that sink. he could, he thinks he could beat her. Muscle no. sinks. Muscle sinks. But you're going to sink. Flow. Just flow. because you have like some big I'm feet. I'm like a modern day Bruce Lee. I got built in flippers, all right? I would drown in that water before I came out a loser. I swear to God, you would. And you're either, gonna drown. I will come out a winner, or I won't come out at all, and then we both go down together. So nobody will ever say, tell the story about how Chase lost in anything ever. Well, I, we still have yet to see it. Cassie leaves town. Well, this is not about me. Anyways. This is about growing up with Gabrielle. Gabrielle, who had uh, two online relationships, stole ideas from Cosmopolitan, two successful YouTube channels, an entire TikTok career, and now her little sister, who is just an athlete. Um, just, just an athlete. An athlete. Got, That's all I am. Got, I'm got, just an athlete. Got to watch it from the outside looking in. So yeah. what was that like? Do you find well, it difficult being in a, a family associated with somebody who has a following? I never found it difficult. Um, it would be weird. We would be like at the mall or something and someone would be like, oh my gosh, are you Gabrielle Moses? And that was always weird for me because I it's just... It's weird for me to so I was Yeah, and then like yesterday... I crack a block. When we were at Disney, yeah. That was... What happened yesterday? Anyways, well, I just like all the people, all the people that people would come up. In. Like I've never experienced that really before. So yeah. that was kind of weird um, growing up. And I... Do people make fun of you? Or like try and talk yes. bad about me to you? Yes. People well, Gab, you are CEO like, of Clickbaiter, so I feel bad for Everyone them. talks about it. <laughs> like, you are yes. the Clickbaiter. They would like, Glad to get the views, okay? <laughs> they, people would come up to me and be like, so, like, did you die or something? Like, I don't know, just, like, would see your... <laughs> the title. Just the video. title and be like, okay, so we all know that that's fake, so what actually what, what happened? happened? So you would just have to explain a lot of stuff yes. to your friends and, and be like... They just liked making fun of it. They'd be like, your sister's, her clickbait's so dumb, or her clickbait's so funny, I don't know. Yeah, well, I mean, like, I remember, like, some of the things that used to pop on uh, my YouTube particularly would be, like, you'd have, like, a thumbnail, and they would just take your eyes, lighten them up a ton, blow your face. I didn't make any of those. And stick an eggplant emoji and be like, yes, ways to make girls wet. And you're, like, 15 at the time doing this. It would be, like, dating advice, how to Snapchat a girl. I never made any of those single thumbnails. I'll pull them up right now. It was not that. It would be, like, 
We did the jelly bean challenge, gone sexual. Like, God, <laughs> like, like yeah, whose ideas are these? I didn't make any of those, I promise you. It was so No, it's weird. on my personal channel. Oh, well, I got them right here, too. Oh, like, I got gosh. the channel. Don't worry. I could just, like, I'm Chase just gonna, is looking for I'm the I'm just going to look at, like, popular videos, how to kiss tutorials, uh, <laughs> being PDA to see my best friends react. These are all, like, gab mounted, gab stung down somebody's throat. Uh, reacting to things girls do but won't admit. It's like this girl taking a shit, it looks like. <laughs> it's reacting. Giving my boyfriend a pregnancy test. Like, what? Forgetting my girlfriend's birthday. No. He cried. Like, this is just a picture of your ass. <laughs> I didn't make those thumbnails, okay? So, uh, or be, titled videos. So I being your audience. sister, I can imagine that people were probably going to her and being like, so can anything you say, like, for real, like, be so for real? Did like, any of the teachers say stuff to you? Teachers? Because we went to the same no, schools. And yeah, we had we a lot of the same, same teachers. Like, in high school, you had a bunch of the same teachers that mm -hmm. I had. No. None Thank of them. God, that would be weird. That would make me out. I had teachers say <laughs> like, stuff to me. My, if your teachers came up to me and were like, hey, I saw Gab's video. <laughs> I'd be like, oh, you'd be cool. surprised it happened. Cool. Like, what, you'd be like, what, okay. Which one did you see? The one of her <laughs> just ass on the thumbnail? Let me, let me just. So let a lot just... of my friends would tell me they would only watch the ones that I was in. Oh, <laughs> like, well, that's nice. Yeah. Being a good friend to you. Aren't you paying your boyfriend to be in one of your one videos? Of so why are you not paying her to be? She needs Great some money. Yeah, You're not in that you. many. You were maybe in like five videos. Say then I want I want a person. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't get paid either I for those videos. Okay? The IRS, now she got yeah. some back pay going on. Like some, hey, some... I didn't get paid for those ones either. So the ones that you were in. Yeah, so. you did get paid for those ones either. It doesn't matter. She, you were getting paid on YouTube. She's hey, in college. Cassie gets a lot of free clothes and makeup. Remember that fake free car you got me? Remember the Jeep? Fake free. Oh, it was your rental car? Yeah, that was a prank that I did on her. I said I was gonna buy her a new car, and I was like, psych, my car's just in the shop. This is what they gave me. Well, you hand me the keys, and I'm like, this is a tag for like <laughs> for a, car, a rental. You. Like, a, <laughs> like you could see the tag. I'm like, it was like, a nice cool, car, though. Great. Did it work? Did you have to pretend to be excited? <laughs> What well, was a prank? She said, "Yeah, I had to." It was a prank. She was You're like, like oh. "I'm not an idiot, like, but I gotta pretend to be an idiot for, hey, for the, the one time, No, the one time I actually did try and buy mom and dad that, the car. I do remember that. Yes, that backfired in my face. I literally went to go buy my parents a car. Went to the dealership. I was ready to pay, and the deal like the car dealer the sales guy knew my parents and he was like you have i'm not going to sell you this car unless you go talk to your parents so i had they, a paperwork and they everything told my parents yeah. yeah so i had the paperwork and everything i was like mom dad like i'm trying to buy you this car my dad goes we just like, bought a car yesterday and yeah. i'm like are you kidding me that what you actually did I that, actually that did. one was and then real. for Christmas, how I tried to pay for all the squirts vet bills too, yeah, all and mom lot. and dad wouldn't take the money. Well, of course they wouldn't. They're not gonna. I take your guys, money. I swear, I try to do nice things, and every single time it backfires. It's not backfiring. It's just they're not. They're your parents. They're not gonna take your money. Well, they should, cause they bought me my entire freaking childhood. They bought you your childhood. Well, they, well, they the bought school my tuition. Oh, wow. yeah. <laughs> Going to That's private fair. Catholic school. Over That'll rack up some. But like, I need to get some views today. So we got to go back into this more serious question. So which out of the two boyfriends did you like least? That is so easy. <laughs> that is the easiest answer I could ever give. And I feel like this could get... <laughs> Like, I feel like I shouldn't no, you because should. I'm so for. passionate about it. Okay. And da -da -da, drum roll. Can I say his name? Yes. You could just say boyfriend one or two. Oh, okay. So boyfriend number one. Jack. Can I talk about him? <laughs> yes. Is it okay? Like. Yes. I never liked him. Never once in my life have I been like, you know, he's a decent guy. No, never. Not from the very first day they started dating all the way through it. So the very end, never What was it me. like day that one was, meeting this guy? What was oh, it? Uh, he drove me crazy. <laughs> he drove me crazy. Day one meeting this guy, what was it like though? Would you remember it? <laughs> you were young. That was you. <laughs> the Justin Bieber hair flip. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> like, the, the, the Justin. He, had, he was a wannabe Justin Bieber, but worse. He never Cassie. quite made it. Cassie's doing a great job right now. Cassie's doing her job. I, you, you asked me a good question, and I'll be honest. You never, like, hung out with this guy? Like, just, like, like not on never, some... 
by choice. Damn, where did I put those? Uh, mm. Like he never, like you guys were never just like out like in movies or like like out at I like didn't a be. like a fair, and you're like, oh, like this guy's like actually decent. No, we would have Not to a beg single you to be in our old videos. Yeah, and bribe you somehow, like buying you sushi and stuff. Well, that and like I got, I got followers uh, on it, so tried. like. He's pulling Tell a video. Gabrielle and Sam, I said hi. Oh. Um, <laughs> Tell Gabrielle and Sam, I said hi. It makes me sick. <laughs> he said hi to you. He's out. He said hi to me. He said the little family. The passive aggressive hi. No, I never liked him. That's tough. So, he said, I just so it was a, it was a good day when they broke up. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, and you guys broke up. She said that's an easy one for me. I applauded. <laughs> Hey. I just didn't appreciate the way he treated you, the way he spoke to you. Disgusting. Wait, this was like he would do it in front of you guys? Mm, it was like a hidden in front of us. Like, Damn. I didn't appreciate it. This is the perspective that nobody gets because this is your, your sibling. She lived there. So, you, so there's always your side where you always try to like water it down. She's just like, hell no. Nah, this motherfucker was talking crazy. <laughs> like, this guy had Justin Bieber hair. Like. Gosh. He bought you some nice... No, I don't think he ever got you anything. <laughs> She's like, got me like a blanket. He got that you a blanket. blanket. It was like a fuzzy blanket, maybe. Really? I don't really remember. Well, it's for one of my Christmas. Trash. One of, do you want to know what's funny? One of the Christmas gifts that he got me was like an MSU Bears backpack and like a carrier case for my MSU? laptop. Mm -hmm. It was something his dad just. Gave I was gonna to him. say he probably got it for free. <laughs> like, there's no way he. And his for dad that. saw me with the backpack and asked me about it whenever I went back over to their house. And his dad was like, "I gave those to like, why do you why do you have those?" And was like, he gave them to me for Christmas. God. Do you remember when they were blowing up on uh, YouTube? Like, was that like a was it like an overnight type of thing, or was it like, oh wow, you guys got a lot of views and then more views and then more views? I, it was more progressive. I don't think it was like. Not that I can remember of like one day the one video went viral. I think it was like a progressive day. Yeah. Yeah, they did it for a while. Where I was always gone filming in high school. Like yeah. I was never home. Well that mm, yeah. Well I just felt like oh, I'm trying to think like was it like you come back and you're like, hey, like I posted a video on YouTube today and I got a hundred views and then next week, oh I got two hundred views. I got a thousand views. Yeah. That's yeah. I think that's more how it was. You're like, holy cow, well, this might actually work out for you. I remember he did like um, video game stuff, and then you joined in. That's when it started getting views. Well, it wasn't even you video game it. stuff. You did like one video without me, and then I started being on the channel. Well, that's he took off some of the older videos. They're not there anymore. Wait, I'm so confused now. He was doing video games, not couple stuff. No, he did like that was like a long stuff. time ago. Like you know how on my channel I did the dating advice. He did kind of like that, but more reaction. It was one the first video. And then I went in it, and then we did the jelly bean challenge. The what is it called? Gone sexual. Yeah, Gone that sexual. one. Yeah, we did that, and then in, it was like the high school challenge. sexual high school. Crazy. We moved the ruler so we could touch each other, guys. Exactly. Exactly. No, but we did like all that pretty quick, like mm -hmm. the couple channel stuff. Once it started getting views, because I want to say our first video together had like three hundred fifty thousand views. And the ones of just him before maybe had 2,000. Yeah. <clears throat> so it switched over. So you're the fast. whole, you're Perfect. the reason. Yeah, basically. You said it, not me. So like, okay, so like was uh, growing up with this, was she a bratty kid or what? <laughs> this, I don't know why this is the first thing to come to my head. Super rude. I just remember like when you would play soccer. <laughs> like When you would super, play soccer. Like, I know, super like random. Like how aggressive I'm you were. I'm about to get roasted. You would play soccer. You... <laughs> I don't know why this is the first thing that, would, that popped in my head, but you would like tackle girls. <laughs> you would play soccer, just body them. Because I was their defense. Yeah, oh, it was so funny. She's like, I'm gonna be yeah. good at this. I'm gonna be real. Right. Like, I asked your dad like, one time. I go, so yeah, it's like, she's an athlete. Is she a oh, horrible athlete? But she I worked know. hard. <laughs> she's not an athlete, but she tried. <laughs> Fair play, we all do that. She was a cheerleader. I was a cheerleader. Uh, there which you is go. crazy because you can't dance. <laughs> if I see your TikToks, you can't dance. No, this I know. Is I crazy. Really can't. No, but I think I used to be like okay at dancing and then it's just gotten worse over time. I was captain, okay? Ca Catholic Catholic cheerleaders. <laughs> hey, we had three teams. We had three teams. Okay? So I beat a lot of people out. I was 
Beat was, a lot of people out. You I was varsity cabin. freshman year. I had 98 people in my class. You're I acting like there were. No, you. Uh, yes, I did. Like, who are you trying to like? I yes, live with I you. Yes, I did. We started taking AG1 because we were so tired of taking so many different supplements and we just wanted a single solution. Since starting to take AG1, I feel so much more awake in the mornings. And not only does it deliver my daily dose of vitamins, minerals, and pre and probiotics and more, but it's also a pretty powerful healthy habit that's really simple. It's one scoop mixed in water once a day, every day. It replaces my multivitamin, but it also covers any nutrient gaps and supports my mental and physical health in just 60 seconds every morning. Try AG1 and get a free free year supply of vitamin D3, K2, and five free AG1 travel packs with your first purchase exclusively at drinkag1.com slash unscripted. That's drinkag1.com slash unscripted. Go check it out. Our class was the biggest one because it was the first one to have C's at it too. It had like all of the elementaries. That's why ours was the biggest. Oh. It actually was by quite a bit. What school was this? Springfield Catholic High School. Springfield Catholic High School. Springfield, home of the O'Reillys. It is. That it is. That it is. It is. He actually went to Cassie's high school graduation. I was there. I was at the. Mm -hmm. Was at the. Oh, was, yeah, that was the first time I met you. Oh yeah. 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 It was graduation. Yep. My awesome. my high school graduation. So random. So random. So random. It's been more random places. You know what's even more crazy is Gabrielle tried to dress me for that day, and I almost showed up in a do rag, like baggy <laughs> pants, like some shorts. I'll never forget this to this day. I remember I we were in Kansas City, and she's like, "Oh, my sister's graduating." She, I was like, "Cool, I'm gonna go down there, meet the fam, say what's up." She hangs out with me all the fucking time, and I was like, "All right." So I go in there, take a shower, and I come out, and I got like a pile of clothes on my bed, <laughs> and I'm sitting there going. I'm sitting there going, I know this girl did not go into my suitcase and pull out an outfit specifically that she wanted me to wear to go meet her family. And so I'm sitting there thinking, I walk out and did you pull out my clothes? She's like, oh yeah, I just thought those would look nice. I'm not wearing none of this. So I like instantly like, threw it away, basically, and pulled out my own clothes. But I was like thinking in my head, I'm about to show up in a do-rag, <laughs> like some, I'm gonna draw some face tattoos on. Uh, I'm gonna be the most ignorant dude from Seattle. I did it. So then what's crazy is I showed up. That. I showed up, I dressed myself, I showed up to uh you had some like golf course thing that you were doing. Gra like, graduation party. Party. Right. And yeah. I walked in there and Every guy in that place, every guy that had, was in attendance was dressed the exact I tell same. You. I could tell you. Dressed the, I could tell you what they were wearing because she picked out the exact same outfit that every one of those guys was wearing. And I looked at her and I said, if I would have showed up in here wearing that, I would have matched all these other little. I would have walked out. I would have walked right out that motherfucker. It's the same. It's like khakis. Khakis and a, and a button polo up. button up, yeah. Polo was, button up. They're like pink yep. and tan. And yeah. Like, <laughs> like, what the hell? Where am I? All the same. Sometimes uh, they'll throw in a hat. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, yeah, you got to have the Bass, Pro, the Bass Pro Shop hats. Hey, know. he, he wears crazy. the Bass yeah. Pro Shop hat. There's a reason I stopped wearing the Bass Pro Shop hat, too. Hey, don't shit on Bass Pro. Nah, he's great. You guys have the, the best one. He's a cool guy. You love the Not fish tank. Not that I know him or anything, but I'm yeah, sure he's Johnny cool Morris. Guy. Johnny Morris. You yeah. love that fish tank. Yeah, you guys got the, the ice cream. Aquarium. The fish down tank, there. it's a whole aquarium. Yeah. The fish tank is insane. Wonders of Wildlife. You guys got a great ice cream shop down there. Andy's. Andy's. He's a big Andy's and fan. And then everybody hangs out at the Walmart parking lot down there in Springfield, Missouri. It's, they do. Dan Kenny. The, it switches back and forth. It goes from. They got banned from Dan Kenny for a while. This was a gym, like a public gym. It was, yeah. Lot. It was like a, Everyone would hang out there. There was a fight in because, my grade. So two people went to the hospital. That we were banned there for a bit, so then it switched to Walmart, Seriously, then back to right. Like we're in Springfield, Missouri, so our options are Two. parking lots. <laughs> we hung out in. It goes crazy, lots. obviously. You should definitely or the world's largest fork. We do have that. You saw which I'm world. proud of. I did not see that. I didn't bring you to that. I, I you know, there's a lot of things. That I went out there. I saw the, like the place you guys go camping. That was cool. Huh? I've never been camping. <laughs> Uh, where's the lake, the lake at? Oh, yeah. the Tim lake. Rockley, I... Yeah. Hmm? There's no camping at the lake? No. no. There's houses you guys... at the lake. My bad. Well, not all. We don't have houses, but I'm just saying, like, yeah. I went, to the, I went and got breakfast at the Table Rock. You know, it was a good Oh, time. oh, um, um, Top I, of the Rock. Top of the Rock, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Top of the Rock. Yeah. That's another Johnny Morris attraction. Yeah, he owns that. Bass that Pro it. owns that. That is it. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, well, my time is in Springfield, Missouri is short-lived, but, like, you know, I, I'm glad that you guys had a successful YouTube channel out there, and then you actually met boyfriend number two out there, too, who Cassie likes oh, yeah, a little Cassie's bit, not more. as much. He more. was, he was, he was, 
He was nice. He was nice. Too, too, too nice. Too nice. Sometimes. Cassie also breaks up with people because they're too nice. She does. I would just like to put that. Oh, no. Cassie's just. Cassie says. She's like, hold on, hold on, hold on. This isn't about me. Calm down here. Uh, <laughs> so, anyways, the other guy. <laughs> he, uh, um. I'm loving this. <laughs> I know you she, are. He. <laughs> she tried not to be super rude, but he was a pushover. Well, from what I heard, the Gabrielle had him on a bedtime. <laughs> He had, a, he had visiting hours to his own girlfriend, so I mean, like, that's great, Gab. You're saying such a good girlfriend you were. I just, I was pre-med and I just had to get stuff done and I couldn't get things done. Yeah, you can visit me from the hours of 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. and then you have to Because he would always try and talk to me and I was like, <laughs> he would always, he would try, always to talk. try and talk to me. We can't have that, Well, obviously. I was just very stressed with school at that point in time. I was trying to graduate. You did graduate the and then you moved to Kansas and was going to leave. Kansas City. Leave, bro. In yeah. Springfield. He followed me there, though. Ugh. Did he live with you? <laughs> no. I already broke up with him by the time I moved. So he was already, he was just in Kansas City, and so were you. Yeah, I never saw him once, though. You never saw him not a single time? He did move there? Yeah, and then oh. left a month later. Oh, well, because he realized. I, thought I, was, I think he thought yeah. I was going to reach out to him. Yeah. Whatever. I haven't talked to him since I broke up with him, really. That was tough. How'd that breakup go again? You just sent him a text. Uh, <laughs> no, sorry, I landed. Hey. Bye. Hey, listen, little I actually girl. landed from being out of town. And oh, yeah. And my was, roommate actually. He was messing out. with somebody else in New York and he no. found out about it. No. Ah, uh -huh. no. no. <laughs> kidding, guys. I was actually visiting one of my friends who got surgery done. And mm. then I was there for two weeks, like helping the girlfriend take care of him. And then. Got back, had my roommate pick me up from the airport, and I went up to his apartment and talked to him, and I was like, hey, I just want to be honest here. Like, this, this is not working such out. such an awkward conversation. It had to be, and he was also not the most easily, easy to talk to guy. So yeah, I had to say it a few times. He was, he, it probably didn't go through the first time. It was probably like, she was probably like, I need some space, and he was like, <laughs> like, oh. like I, I moved two feet over. Like that space, right? Yeah. That's, that's... He was a v I want to say he was a nice person, just not for me. You always say he's a nice person. Because I don't have anything bad to yeah. say. Yeah, they're... I really don't have anything bad no, to say. Uh, to be fair, like I will vouch for it. You've never said anything bad. The other one I will not vouch for, but <laughs> for this one you have always said. Yeah. Hey, he is nice. And, and, yeah. and He just was not the person for me and I knew that. And so why prolong it if I didn't see myself with him? Beautifully. Wait, how did, you meet, how did you meet said person? Because he lived in my apartment building. Oh, okay, that's right. Yeah. That's right. Didn't everybody live at that same Yeah, building? my apartment oh, yeah, building was did live popping. There. Did you go there a lot? Yeah. Yes, um, yes, yes. Uh, Wait, let's tell a story. Oh, yeah. Let's tell a story okay. about Cassie's second boyfriend. Second boy, hey, so her first day. boyfriend right now is going to be watching this. So, I mean, go ahead, tell a story. So, hold on, before you tell the story, let <laughs> Which me. story? Like, say, well, let so me... you skipping swim practice. Oh, that was so bad. Okay, so let me tell I the story. So much this trouble. is such a good story. Why shouldn't I tell so, the story? Yeah, like, let okay, Cassie fine, you tell the story. story. Okay, but Unless she misses them, you can chime in. So, my ex boyfriend and I, I, was, I drove him to practice. Swim One day, swim practice, and, we and were all like, your boyfriends are on the swim team, right? No, only two of them have been. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Anyways, <laughs> so we were on our way, and he was like, ah, "We should just skip practice." And I was like, "Oh, you know, I don't know. I'm a good girl. Skipping I don't practice. do that." And then he convinced me, and so we did. But my coach and I are. I was, we were close. My coach and I were close, and I was one of the better people on the team. But you forgot to mention something. What? Before you skipped practice, you drove to practice and ditched your phone in totally a bush. Because she had, had Life360. Life 360. <laughs> so I was like, well. What is Life360? It's a tracker. <laughs> Basically, it's a, <clears throat> so my coach. mother can see where I am at all times. I still have it, so my mom currently knows exactly where I am right now. She checks. Yeah, she, she, she checks. She would, 
like this year still, she would screenshot and be like, hey, your Life360 is not working. I'm like, I'm 20 years old. Why are you even looking right now? Like, <laughs> Yeah, anyway, so she ditches her phone in the bush, <laughs> then skips practice. Yes. So her phone says she's on campus where the swimming pool was. Mm -hmm. And the swim coach calls mom and dad, and it's like, your daughter didn't show like, up to Obviously, practice. it's not like me to skip practice. So like, they thought I, I'm was always wrong. there, always they there. They thought she was kidnapped. They thought she got in a car wreck. But they can't find her, and I live five minutes away from campus because she swam at my college. Yeah. And, and so, okay, so back to Kaz. Finish the story, Kaz. So what happened? So she, so I ditched my phone. <laughs> we literally just like went and like drove around because we had nothing to do. Like obviously we should have just gone to practice. But his mom calls him and he's like, she knows I'm at practice. Like she wouldn't call me unless there's something wrong. So he ends up answering. And she's like, where the hell are you guys? Like, your coach called, like, blah, blah, blah. And Sarah and Jim were not happy campers. Sarah and Jim. My parents. Sorry, yeah, that's our parents. Not happy. Whew. That's the so what does like, that have but to do that's like building? really scaled down. Like my dad is like wanting to file a police report. Literally, he, wants he wanted to, call to like call the police. He thinks Cassie got kidnapped, so I'm the closest by, and I just so happen to be with my roommate and one of my other sorority sisters who is just in her wedding. Cassie's actually, Cassie's been in trouble. They're like, can you guys five please, minutes of going please crazy. drive to campus, go find Cassie. Like, we're so worried. This is Send your other to daughter to find the kidnapped daughter. Great. Yes, yeah, so but, but I brought my two friends with me. Oh, Allie perfect. And Madeline. They get a three for Madeline. one special now. Yes. So we're searching everywhere where it says a phone location. <laughs> we're going through bushes. We're going through grass. We can't find this phone location. So I'm telling my parents, like, she's not here. Her phone's not here. My mom thinks she was kidnapped at this point. So you found the phone in the bush. No, so well, that so, so they we drove back <laughs> to the campus car stop and we stop in, on like the side of the road. I <laughs> see her yank her phone. And Gabrielle was there and I You were there. I How did she grab my there? phone? Well, because she was looking for me. And my parents were on their way to campus, but they were further. Oh, away. so you were driving she and you saw there. You saw yeah. her. Yes, so I saw her because I was. And when like, she got out of the car, trying to act like mom, like Cassie. No, I was dying for you. No, then she. she was was like, like, dude, you better find something good to say. Like, yeah, I was like, they're Cassie, mad. This is not good. So like, I would just be like, look, I'm in high school. I wanted to skip with my boyfriend and criminalize me. I would have just. Ch I no, it was hard. criminal. This this blew up into like a whole situation that. Anyways, guys, if you want to hear how the story ends, stay tuned for next week. April 24th and you're gonna find out what exactly happened to Cassie and you're gonna hear a little bit more tea on me because Cassie and Chase just really love to gang up on me the entire time I went home and cried after this but anyways thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one